Hello there, great people. Thank you so much for stopping by. Nuno here, greetings from Portugal. So today, the 15th of November, Apple released the third beta of macOS Mojave 10.14.2. Now, let's start as always for you guys that are already subscribed to the channel. Let's go ahead to the build number for this release. So the build number, it is the 18C48A. Uh, let's see how many betas Apple will release till the final build. Now the downloads amount for this build was about, well, it is, you know, the same as the first beta and the second beta, 2.46. So uh, in my system, of course, you can check the specs on the first slide that I showed you. Now let's go here to the, the geek bench or the benchmark synthetic benchmark so on this release this is the results okay this is the oh no this build okay now on the geek on the beta 2 these were the results now we are seeing a slight increase over here uh, even though it is uh, lower than 10.14.1 but you know, we are seeing here a small increase, uh, you know, and this is neglectable on the single core, you know, almost the same. But of course, I just installed macOS Mojave. I have to wait a few days in order to see how it goes. Now, these were the results for the benchmarks regarding metal performance uh, on this device. Let me check here the for this beta these were the results we are seeing you know this is it is increased um, from the 10.14.1 and uh, you know very slight results on beta 2 beta beta 3 so this is the current one okay now let's now check uh, if they fixed anything um, you uh, of course, the, the PDF, when you highlight, as you can see, still the same, still a dark blue. I don't know why, uh, doesn't make any sense because uh, why not a high, uh, no, uh, no, a light blue in order for you to see what you are highlighting. Of course, if you want to highlight everything, it is okay. But when you, uh, you know, want to highlight something, this is this is, doesn't seem the perfect color. Okay, not good for me. Not resolved on this beta three. Now, regarding the FaceTime, one of the uh, one of the things that was released on this um, on this 10.14.2 the group group FaceTime um, everything seems to be uh, in working order let's go ahead let's call myself okay to my phone and see how it goes okay perfect seems to work okay let me mute this over here if I can okay sorry about that guys now uh, the new interface still remains as you can see over here okay so perfect everything seems to be in working order let's take a screenshot live photos must, must be enabled on both devices it's not enabled on mine so that's why on my iPhone that's why I cannot take the, the live photos if you take that live photo the live photo will be uh, on your photos app on live photos too many live now let's quit this call very well everything seems to be working now regarding one of the things that i've been noticing some of you some of my viewers and subscribers uh, are telling that they have lag uh, in the mouse and opening applications guys this is a mid 2015 macbook pro uh, core i7 16 gigs of ram two, ga two uh, dual graphic cards integrated and dedicated so uh, one of the things that uh, i noticed is is youtube i know that some of you don't have this issue but you know see this lag i'm scrolling and it takes a little while 
to render but then everything seems to be smooth i don't know put on the comments below if you have this issue or not again youtube player and uh, overall let's go to i want to go to my videos but uh, let me go here let me check in order not to blur anything let me go to my videos over here uh, one of the things that uh, let me put this one this is the new video that i just released when i go to full screen guys everything seems seems okay no problem here then when i want to go again see i have this issue this is the new youtube player that was released you know two days or three days ago and uh, i have this this issue I don't, I don't know why as you can see it's over there and remains like this so i don't know what what is going on tell me if you have this bug also i tested in other browsers and they seem to be okay in chrome in opera and firefox seems to be okay in safari they don't even with this uh, build now everything seems to be rendering okay very quick i will release by the way guys a new video on how to improve uh, your speed okay on your mac so count on that if you want to see uh, there is a subscribe button over there not selling anything guys okay <laughs> now new things over here that we can talk nothing new guys no new no new uh, i'm hoping that apple you know release dynamic uh, wallpapers but no still they are still the same the login screen still uh, is the same old Mac OS Mojave, okay? If you even if you have a different wallpaper, the Mac OS Mojave login uh, when when you start your computer is the same. Not on standby, the standby it is the wallpaper that you choose, but when you log in, uh, the wallpaper you know it's the 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 usual. Now I always like to tell you about performance over here uh, on this app that I have on my menu bar and uh, you know temperature wins with screen recording very good the fans are kicking a little bit here 62 degrees celsius memory usage about um, five gigabytes of the 16 available keep in mind that i have safari and youtube uh, itunes open sorry so that's why cpu when screen recording about three percent so everything seems okay battery wise guys on regarding the beta 2 no issues whatsoever keep in mind also that i always tell this i always have my computer connected okay that's why with this three-year-old machine only has 35 cycles okay so now uh one thing uh i released the video for you guys that like new things if you want full dark modes on safari guys that is that i will leave on the card upset uh, up on the right top corner you can see that check on how you can have full dark mode on safari okay this is nice okay now on the same on the same thing if you want to turn to with one click here on the menu bar to light mode here you are in light mode okay and then again turn off okay just a, a freebie guys let's go to dark mode again so for now this is all this is all that i can show you uh, of course on the next few days i will test if there is anything you know uh, major in order to do a follow-up video guys final cut was finally updated to 10.4.4 good news oh i'm still here with 10.4.3 but i will update you know in order to see if there is anything new i keep you posted on that for now this is all keep safe and i'll see you in the next one bye bye